My name is Joshua, and this is my story, the story of being gay. Before I came out, nobody noticed me, but when I did, everyone began to see me. I think I might be gay. Faggot! Our friendship is over! Faggot, 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 So that was it. I had lost a friend of seven years to some stupid prodigious, and to make matters worse, things were about to get bad at home. Dad, are you, are you there? Dad? Dad? Hi, Dad. Dad? 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 Dad, speak to me. Dad, Dad, come on. Are you okay? Dad? Dad? What are you doing? Dad, speak to me. I am here. Dad? 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 Oh, so that's how it's going to be then. Homophobia, the worst disease You can't love who you want to love in times like these Homophobia, the worst disease You can't love who you want to love in times like these For seven long months the bullying went on From not just Amy and my dad, from everyone It was hell, just hell and things weren't looking like they were going to get better. Oh my, Joshua, uh, are you okay? Yes. Would you like to just come and have a little chat? Come, come, come with me, please. Come with me. In you come, Joshua. Just. Sit yourself down there. Now, is everything okay at home, Joshua? Yeah. And is everything okay at school? Yeah, everything's fine. Now, you do know I'm the guidance counsellor, don't you? Yeah. You can tell me anything if you want to. Yeah. So, can I ask you again? Is everything all right, Joshua? So I told Mr. Kant everything. The ignoring, the bullying, and of course the self-harming. It just felt so good to talk to someone. And, by the end, he had come up with the perfect solution. I've got a fantastic idea. Mr. Kant's idea was genius. To put on a gay pride disco and invite everyone to help. At first, I was sure no one would come, but the mention of free food seemed to reel them in. I'm so happy that I finally talked to someone. Okay, well, you know, thanks for all your help and everything. See you later. Uh, Amy, it's, it's 4.30. Shouldn't you be hurrying up and going home? Wait for more minutes. I just want to finish this. Well, why can't Joshua go anyway? I'm the assistant creator. I have, I have to keep on checking everyone. Work. I know. Let's liven this place up a little bit, shall we? Let's turn up the music. Oh, I love this song. Really? I'll you see you guys. This song. Yeah, why? Do you know what it's about, right? No. What? Gay quality. Oh, okay. Right. Listen, I've been in, I've been meaning to talk to you. I I'm so sorry for what happened. But it's okay. I mean, I didn't, I didn't mean to offend you. I, I, 
don't want you to think I'm homophobic. I don't think you're homophobic. If you're homophobic, you wouldn't be here saying I'm from gay pride this show. It's not okay, I feel terrible. No, I forgive you, just don't do it again. Man, you've loved girls since before pre-K. Now guys, we've only got like half an hour to set up, so if you guys get on with it, I'll go get the rest. Where is everyone that was here on Monday? Isn't that obvious? Is that okay? Hates me. Have you read the YouTube comments lately? Man, that's gay. Gets dropped on the daily. We become so numb to what we're saying. A culture founded from oppression. Yeah, we don't have acceptance for them. Call each other faggots behind the keys of a message board. A word rooted in hate. Yet our genre still ignores it. Gay is synonymous with the lesser. It's the same hate that's caused wars from religion. Gender to skin color, the complexion of your pigment, the same fight that led people to walkouts and sit-ins. It's human rights for everybody. There is no difference.